Good morning, day 44. Looking out my tent for the last time on my Ireland Way journey. Look at that. Overlooking the North Atlantic Ocean. What do you call it? North Atlantic Sea. Whatever. Beautiful. How do you like to wake up to this view every day? Well, in my very unwise decision, well, it's a nice day. I'll walk surely up there at that pole over. I'll have a trail. No, no, it's all road. I walked two miles and I'm at the top of this hill, the bus stop. There's a bus, Carniti, I think it's across the way from the Glenmore House B&B restaurant and stuff. So I'm gonna stand here because the bus should be coming pretty soon. I'm gonna stand here, eat my trail mix. <laughs> and admit defeat and take the bus into Bally Castle. On the bus well, to Bally Castle. I, I walked for two miles. I, uh, it's ridiculous. Uh, you cannot. If you get into Ballantoy, don't even bother walking. Just catch the bus because you're gonna, you're gonna be going on this road that's not safe. Well, I am walking through Valley Castle to the Information Center, so my last bit is walking. The children of Lear. <laughs> Valley Castle. I was okay until I saw it. The end of the road, folks. It's a monumental, monumental end of the road. Oh. This is it. End of the road. Children of Lear. And the end of my trip. Bye. I'm not very good at this. There we go. Ah, oh, it's amazing. It's amazing weather. And now I've got to go to the information center and get my stamp. Or at least a hearty congratulations. <laughs> Made it to the information center. And guess what I have? <laughs> yes. Yes, yes, and a stamp. <sighs> now I'm going to find a place to stay, and I know where to get a big steak. And the sun is shining, the sky is blue, the weather's mild, all's good in the world. First roses of the day. It happens to be in the last place I'm stopped at, right next to the information center, Valley Castle. It's beautiful. And they smell so nice. <laughs> Welcome to Bally Castle. I'll turn around. And the harbor. And the blue sky. And the flowers. And did I mention the blue sky? <laughs> See the Marine Hotel? I just booked a room in there for tonight. Cost 125 pounds. I do not care. It's right across where I catch the bus to go to Belfast tomorrow and across from the park. And the beach, which I'm going to right now, take my shoes and socks off, sit in the sand, air them out. I can't go in the room for another few hours it's not ready yet but <sighs> yeah baby and I know where to go for a steak dinner tonight it's all squared away hallelujah I made it to Valley Castle it's a sunny day I can't say it enough
I've got a room, I've got my certificate. <laughs> I just... Yeah. I did it. I did it. Ah, oh, I feel like that song, but with the ass in the sand, except mine is the feet in the sand. Ah, oh, look at this. They're getting all dry. Sun, and look at, there's some water. There's a little stream. Guess where my feet are going in a minute. And then back to the sand. Oh my God, this is, this is heaven. Look at this. This is my reward. I've been rewarded. I'm sitting here waxing poetic. This is my, this is my farewell to arms or something, to the, the Ireland Way. Sailboats, sand, water, beachheads, sunshine. Wow. <gasps> ah, I've got my feet in the Atlantic, the North Atlantic Ocean. Ah, burr. Ah. Or maybe at this way, I think it's not much. Whoa, Betsy, that's cold. God. Yeah. But the North Atlantic Ocean that comes in in a little harbor. There we go. Walking, walking in the ocean. <laughs> Gosh, that's cold. Oh, my feet feel so nice. <laughs> now I've got to find a patch of sun. Go back to the sunshine. Even the dogs are having fun in the sun. Just having a good time. And a little girl in her <laughs> little fairy skirt. How cute is that? That is just the cutest thing. This is what nearly 630 miles looks like on a pair of or soles of my the soles of my shoes. Not bad. A little a little wear. A little wear on the tread. <laughs> Maybe a lot of wear on the tread. They stood the test. Yeah. These, uh, these hokas like did good. That. Did good. Sitting on a bench overlooking the playground, eating my double scoop ice cream cone, chocolate chip mint on the bottom, strawberry on top. You better take a quick look now because it's not going to last. <laughs> Can you see what's right with this picture? That's right, a little tiny Baileys in my tea. I'll show you how big it is. See how big it is? <laughs> See, that's my celebratory tea with Bailey's. That's right. There's an, one of those old fashioned official funeral processions. Wow. Hi, everybody. <laughs> I'm officially done. I'm officially finished with the Ireland Way. Hmm. Ah, it's my view out the window. It's a side street, not a very pretty view. If I go to the window, I would turn a little to my left and you can see the bay, but uh, I don't want to, because I'm sitting on my bed. <laughs> Wiggling my clean toes, ah, not in the sand. Well, look at my lovely tan line, would you? <laughs> this is where my socks were 
It's like the Camino tan. <laughs> That's what they call the Camino tan. <laughs> anyway, yes, so I'm going to officially end today. I'm officially ending. Look at that sad book. I had to tape the binding and the edges because I take it in and out of my um, waste pack so many times. I, it was making the edges icky. <laughs> There's my calendar. So, I brought the tape for that reason. So, day 44 is done. My Ireland way is completed. Satisfaction. Monumental. For me, anyway, it was just something else. And I made the last two days with beautiful weather. Today was even better than yesterday. I finally rolled my pants, got my bottoms of my pants off, and I walked around in short leg pants. I don't know why I put my bottoms on the other day. So, getting ready for my lovely steak dinner tonight. <sighs> and the hotel cost includes breakfast. Perfect. It's great. And the bus doesn't leave till probably a quarter after 10. I'm taking the bus to Coleraine, where I'm gonna take the train to Belfast. And then from Belfast, take bus down to Newcastle, and then from Newcastle to Kikiel. It'll be a bit of a, a changing buses, but I'll get there. So boys and girls, day 44 is in the books. The Ireland Way is in the books. Thanks. Thanks for com <laughs> Thanks for coming along for the ride. It was an adventure. <laughs> it was an adventure, that's for sure. And I wasn't alone. I may have walked by myself, but I had a multitude of angels under my wings. I didn't, uh, I didn't do this alone. There were uh, terrific people all along the way. In incredible. I can't even begin to name, name them all. At every corner, there was somebody to give me a, li a, you know, a boost, give me a helping hand, give me information, gi give me a place to sleep in their backyard, um, sometimes in their house, <laughs> and make me lunch, Margaret. <laughs> and, oh, well, there's other people that made me lunch, too. I mean, invite me into their house, gave me tea, fed me. It's just totally incredible people all along the way. So, no, I wasn't alone. I had the wings of many, many trail angels underneath me. And I can't even begin to thank, thank them all enough. It made everything unfold perfectly. Thank you so much.